So the Lonsdale Cup will complete day two. Then this is a two-mile group two event. And Charming Princess is at the top for David Hooley. Lakeland Highlands, Darren Thompson. Reno Response, Vinnie Gerard. Baltic October, Graham Clutterbuck. Diamond Jubilee, Craig Beckwith. Faustan Lenore, David Robertson. King at Night and Secret Plans for Leon Van Rensburg. Beam for Craig Beckwith. Hidden Stats for Craig Allen. Mirror Mirror for Patrick Hogan. Nine Lives, Joshua Sutherland. So I Told You, David Hooley. And Illusoria Beata for Paul Rose. So 14 of them then facing the starter in this one. The final race of the day, and away they go. And secret plans was away well. So she was the grey Faust on Lenore. And it's Faust on Lenore who's going across to the road. He's going to lead, I think, from it. Soria Beata, who usually likes to run up with a pace as well. So they're passing the winning post then on this first time. They've got a full circuit of the York track to go. And Faust on Lenore on the inside of it. Soria Beata. They're the one and two. Baltic October back in third for Graham Clutterbuck. And there's a gap of three lengths then to Lakeland Highlands in fourth with Reno Response and King at Night. Then Secret Plans and Charming Princess. Mirror Mirror is in that little group as well. Nine Lives is the one that's running quite wide on the track as we now see them from the other angle. And Faust on Lenore has opened up into a two length lead to Illusoria Beata in second and Baltic October third. Gap of two or three then back to Lakeland Highlands. Then Reno Response in the green. Leon van Rensburg's blue of King at Night is after that one. The grey is Charming Princess in the purple jacket. Then behind that one, Diamond Jubilee Hidden Stance is also tucked in on the inside. Nine Lines is still wide on the track, so I told you, and Secret Plans are still the back two. Beam is also nearer the back and the front, but it's Faust on Lenore who leads by four lengths. Then for David Robertson to Illusoria Beata for Paul Road second. Baltic October Graham Clutterbuck third, and then back in fourth, Lakeland Highlands Darren Thompson. Then comes Diamond Jubilee for Craig Beckwith and King at Night for Leon Van Rensburg with Reno Response for Vinnie Gerard after that one, and then Miramir for Padraig Hogan, Charming Princess, David Hooley, Hidden Stance for Greg Allen, so I told you for David Hooley as well, then Nine Lives for Joshua Sutherland, Wide on the Track, Beam for Greg Beckwith, and finally Secret Plans at the back for Leon Van Rensburg, but Faust on Lenormand into the final mile in the Lonsdale Cup, leads by five to Illusoria Beata in second, Baltic October is third, and Diamond Jubilee is four, then Reno Response, Lakeland Highlands, Miramir is after that one, Nine Lives despite being wide on the track, he's still getting closer, then comes Charming Princess, King at Night is trying to make a forward move. Beam is still the back marker, but it's Faust on Lenore who continues to lead, but only by two and a half and a three. To Illusoria Beata in second, a similar length up on Baltic October in third. Charming Princess in the second, grazed into fourth. Then comes Nine Lives on the outside of Miramir. So I told you he's trying to make a forward move. So is Diamond Jubilee trapped on the inside is Lakeland Highlands and trying now to swing around the outside is Reno Response. But it's Faust on Lenore who swings into this long York straight with a lead of about a length and a half over Illusoria Beata in second. Baltic October is third and Charming Princess is four. Then comes Mirror Mirror and Nine Lives. So I told you up the inside. Then Diamond Jubilee Secret Plans is trying to get going. So too is King at Night but it's still Faust on Lenore by two. From Illusoria Beata. Mirror Mirror is now through into third. Nine Lives in fourth. Baltic October on the inside between the two of them. The Great Charming Princess but Faust on Lenore is still three clear with two and a half furlongs to go. It's Faust on Lenore in the lead from Mirror Mirror in second. Then comes in Asoria Beata, Charming Princess, Baltic October, Nine Lives, so I told you. All still in with chances, but they've got to get to this leader. False on Lenore being pushed along in the lead, then Furlong and half to go, still three lengths up on Mirror Mirror in second. In Asoria Beata and Charming Princess, then Baltic October, and Nine Lives, nothing really coming out of the pack. False on Lenore still going well in the lead inside the final half, Furlong and False on Lenore. Looks like she might have stolen this one from the front, racing up towards the line. False on Lenore takes the runs now, could be going to be a great one too, because Charming Princess is second. Sorry, it'll be out of third then Baltic October. So I told you, nine lives been finished well. And Faust on Lenore got into the lead and stayed there. And he just felt she was about to get swallowed up by the rest of the pack, but managed to maintain that lead. And it didn't really go down at all, did it? So Faust on Lenore takes it for David Robertson. A good three and a half length win with Charming Princess second for David Hooley. Illusoria Beata for Paul Rhodes was third. Baltic October in fourth for Graham Clutterbuck. And so I told you for David Hooley was fifth.